Ryobi 18 volt 10 inch saw comes with the, the chain cover pretty decent it's got an automatic oiler not automatic you have to push it that's the only thing I don't like about it it's the oil you got to push it to get the oil going through there I got an 18 volt battery in there I've cut up numerous trees and brush and branches with this this is my cleanup I bust I trim all the pieces off the branches into them uh, sizes right there and I got these right here I'm going to show you I'm going to cut this up I cut all them up and that up all this brush not brush but branches trim these trees all the way up they're dead cut all those branches up with that Ryobi chainsaw 10 inch and you know what? That blade is still sharp. All right, I haven't sharpened it or changed it. All right, that's that's quite a bit of of uh, wood there. All right, so <clears throat> I'm gonna show you just how good it does. Pretty good. I'm gonna cut these up just to give you an idea of what's going on with it. I'm happy with it because I, I got the 18 volt system. Everything I have is 18 volts for the Ryobi. All right. It's got the safety right here. You got to pull it. You need to remove the cover first. Pull that towards you. Get it going. Okay, you get it going and then you place it down on the log. You don't put it on the log and turn it on. Remember, this is cut a lot of wood. Did you see them chips coming out of there? You don't uh, see that too often with a gas power chainsaw. It usually gets sawdust because everybody doesn't keep their chain sharp. The chain on a uh, gas-powered chainsaw goes so fast that it overheats the chain up and dulls it up real fast. And this doesn't go real fast, so it does it does is cut. Okay. Let me double check to make sure you can see it. All right, that's good. All right. I'm not pushing the chainsaw in there. The chainsaw is doing all the work. There's the little grips right here on um, your gas powered chainsaw. It's got a metal one. This is just plastic and I'm just working it down. I'm not pushing it or nothing. It's doing the cutting. It's doing all the work for me. So if you got any question about getting one of these, go ahead and get it. You know, this is the regular brush one. This is not the brushless. I didn't buy the brushless because I didn't know how good this was going to work out for me if I was going to like it. But with all the wood that I cut, I love it. So I've got a gas-powered chainsaw. You know, for how much I use that one, it always seems like the Always got to change the gas, drain the gas, clean the carburetor. This, I just put a battery in and I go. I haven't even sharpened the chain yet. And I had this thing for six months. And I've cut up. I got two trees there. I got another tree over there and another tree back over there. I'm in, I'm in the process of getting three ready to cut down. I'll use a electric Remington chainsaw to cut them because I don't have the big one for Ryobi. I only got the 10 inch. So any question about the Ryobi, 
you just give me a email me text me whatever i'll answer man i have no problems the only problem i don't like is it's not automatic you gotta push it every once in a while you know but it does good i cleaned up all them logs and all them branches okay that's it